Hey, what's going on, guys? Hope you're doing awesome, possum. Welcome back to Kingdoms and Castles. This is episode 44. So we are living up life, living it great in the kingdom of the gods. We're uh, still working on expanding over here into this uh, northwestern peninsula area. We still got some buildings constructing, doing some hot construction action. By the way, uh, if you guys end up liking what you see in this episode, feel free to... Oh, God. We got bread. Uh, feel free to uh, smash that thumbs up and consider subscribing as well. If you haven't, that would be absolutely splendid. So, yeah, these peeps are a little bit hungry. Hopefully. Hopefully I can do something about that. Here, let's... Uh... You know what? Let's slap down a couple more... A couple more farms for these peeps, shall we? Oh, it's got to receive irrigation. Let's see. Oh, it looks like we had some damage over here I didn't really notice. All right. All right. We can take care of that. No problem. Should be easy. Squeezy lemon peasy. There we go. So that is going to be something we're going to have to worry about, unfortunately. I'm thinking I may try to interconnect the rest of these Norias with each other so that if one line goes down the other line can help back it up all right so let's let's see if we can make that a thing so how much space is that going to cover that's going to go to like right there so we're going to need another one like right there that would be that'd be amazing that'd be outstanding wouldn't it don't lie you know it would be <laughs> All right, uh, let's go place that right there like a so. Let's let time flow a little bit. Get some stuff and things happening. And we'll get that going like a so. Well, these guys are going to be a little hungry for a little while. That's all right. They'll uh, they'll just have to deal with it, you know. That's that's just the price you pay for living in a kingdom this damn glorious. All right. <laughs> so yeah, the food shortage is kind of making them a little unhappy. Bunch of whiners, if you ask me. But let's uh, let's throw a festival. We'll party it up. Get the party rocking. Get it rolling. Get it grooving. Get it moving. You know what I'm saying? All right, so let's get time going a little bit more. All right, let's sort of plan out how we're going to do another aqueduct Noria system. So we can do one right there. That'd be kind of cool. Hmm, I'm thinking how I want to... Whoa. I'm thinking of how I want to do this. I think even though I don't... Even though I do not like doing this, I'm going to go ahead and run this down the road. Even though it looks terrible. <laughs> we're just going to go straight across. And that's how we're going to connect these bad boys. Some hot flowing water action. And let's also get these castle block walls built back up. Gotta get that defense, you know? Alright, let's uh, speed time up to the max. To the max. And we'll do road like that. And then we'll just fill this place in with like, uh, you know, one orchard and three farms. We could even put some farms back here if we wanted. How's this water going to do once that fountain's up and running? It's going to cover pretty much that whole area. That's pretty cool. So we could go ahead and get ready. Some more water. So we'll slap a fountain down right there. Beautiful. Beautiful. And you know what? Let's go ahead and do one more charcoal. Is that Baker getting all he needs? No, he's not getting enough food. My god. 
like they're carrying food in between the areas. Let's go check out the merchant, see if he's got anything we want. We got 10,000 buckaroonies. We can store up to 15 hundo. Or sorry, 15,000. All right, we can sell, all right, sweet. We got some wood. We can sell 300 wood, 100 stone. We can sell 120 iron, 50 tools, and 50 armaments for 1440. And we will call that good. Let's let the game keep chugging along. Let it keep rocking, let it keep rolling. Let's move these guys a little, oops. Move these guys a little bit closer over here. There we go. Right on. I want to make sure I still have enough defenses. Cemetery's looking good. Year 741. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Alright, did I finish building all the stuff and things over here? Alright, cool. Defenses are up. I feel like I was going to build more defenses over here, or, or I was going to do something else. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, are we doing okay with food? We don't have a food shortage. We're good. We could use another festival, though. We could get another party rocking and rolling. This is a party town now, as you guys are well aware. I mean, after you get 5,000 people, all you can do is party. Party till the end of time. Party till the end of the world. All right, year 742, baby. I still don't know what tithing the cathedrals or churches does. Kind of weird. The church just just thanked me for my donation, but I don't know if it does anything. I don't know. I don't think it increases happiness or anything like that. I don't know. Uh, 199 people enjoyed my festival so dang much that they decided to stay to serve me, baby. All right, these guys still want uh, these guys still want food. They want charcoal. We're getting charcoal up and running right here. Should we place even more charcoal? We could. We sure darn could. You know what? Let's go ahead and do a, another charcoal, and we'll do a small stockpile and have it store only charcoal, just in case we start producing an excess amount. Happiness is going kind of low because of the food shortage again. My God, <laughs> it's like every other episode I have a problem with food. Do we have a hole in the line? I think we just need more Norias again, don't we? I think... I think that may be the case. I believe it is, in fact, the case. Alright, so let's, uh... Wait, can we connect it through... Through the wall? Hmm... I wish I could build more piers over here. Anyway! Let's go ahead and slap a one right there. Can you- oh no, I was about to ask if I could build Norias over stockpiles, but there's no way, Jose. No way. Alright, um... <laughs> oh, you know what? Actually, I could connect these Norias through the wall. Look at that. I could just be like, ba-bam, ba-bam, ba-bam. And now that Noria that's in the wall... I wonder if those three Norias are gonna be enough... ...to irrigate all this stuff. As well as this stuff. That'd be interesting. I guess we'll uh, we'll find out here in a moment, shall we? Two peasants died of the plague. What a bunch of little babies. You guys got to get some penicillin. Everybody's unhappy because of the plagues and the food situation. Throw another party. Get some plus 15 happiness in here. Distract them all, you know, with some... With some nice music, some booze, maybe some uh, some pretty some pretty gals. That, that'll make them happy, right? All right, Baker's getting enough food. Well, now he's not. Dang it! <laughs> Fluctuates a lot. It looks like. Yeah, I'm really I'm really curious to see what happens when this completes. If that's going to irrigate that. We're gonna find out in a moment. It did! Alright, it, it irrigated that, but it didn't irrigate all the way over here. <laughs> oh, but cool, I can uh, I can do the orchard now. 
as well as those three farms. Beautiful, loving it. So we need one more Noria. I'm kind of wondering now if I should just uh, if I should just connect these Norias to these Norias. Oh, lag army's coming. Year 745, the year of the lag army invasion. Let's see where are these fools are coming from. We got... That's not all of them, that's most of them. And they're coming from... Okay, they're coming from down here at the, uh, at the southwest peninsula area. They're probably gonna travel on over to my northern section right there. Is that all of them though? Maybe that is all of them. Alright, let's let time flow. Let's slow it down a little bit though to the middle speed so we can kind of manage this a little bit better. How long do I have until I can smite these suckas? How long? Uh, 37 years until I can smite them again. Alright, no worries. Uh, uh, happiness is okay. We don't have a food shortage uh, again, so we're good. Let's throw another festival just to get that happiness up and up and going. You know what? Let's slow time down all the way just so I can sort of work on doing all this stuff while uh, while that's happening. And you know what? I think a smart move would be if I were to connect this Noria to this bathhouse, which will also connect it to this Noria. And then I'm thinking, even though I hate doing it, and you guys know I hate doing it, <laughs> I think I'm gonna run an aqueduct all the way over here. So it'll connect to those two Norias. That's gonna be one huge aqueduct system, isn't it, guys? That's gonna be nuts. Well, they're doing it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> It's just so crazy. No. Oh, they're breaking through. They're Hulk smashing it. I need more masons is what I need. I Oh gosh. Whoa, how they get through? What the heck? That's weird. Oh, now they're gonna destroy my now they're gonna destroy my aqueducts, aren't they? Gosh, they are. Whew. They are going at it, baby. Throw another festival. Jeez! <laughs> it's so crazy. No. They are wrecking me, dude. They are wrecking my face. Look at that. They're destroying the houses. Let's go rebuild all that stuff. Are they leaving my aqueducts alone? Looks like it. We got one year until the dragons come. That's not a big deal, though. That doesn't really matter at all. Jeez Louise, man. How is anyone supposed to defend against this? <laughs> it's laughable. It's crazy. All right, let's speed him up a little bit. Sire, 1,661 new people visited for the festival. They destroyed uh, some of my houses, though, so it looks like I don't think anyone stayed. Good golly, gee whiz. Gee whiz, fellers. Oh, yeah, I gotta chop down this tree again. 
All right, so that aqueduct is connected. Did that assist at all? Uh, I think it, I don't know. Did it help it move a little bit further? The water's down here now. Gotta get that tree knocked down so we can connect these two right here. That should help out a lot, I would imagine. There we go, let's get that constructed. Carnage just, uh, just doesn't stop, does it? It's brutal. Brutal. All right, how do we, how do we want to connect to these guys now? trying to plan what I want to do over here. I think I want to do more farms. What if I were to do another farm like that? Man, will they just leave already? My god, give it up guys, give it up! How do they keep reproducing like this? <laughs> they must be really, really good at love making. <laughs> Just squirting out new people every year. Yeah, I need more masons. This is brutal. I mean, I have a lot of masons over here, don't I? Jeez, dude. <laughs> oh no, now I gotta rebuild the aqueduct. Oh, that's such a pain in the butthole, dude. Okay, this is all connected now. That's badass. But that's probably just because my aqueduct is destroyed. Would you guys just leave? For the love of God. <laughs> now watch, uh, once they finally leave, after it stops saying uh, Vikings invading, it's probably gonna be like three years until the, uh, until the next Viking invasion comes. It's gonna be relentless. Oh my god, go away! <laughs> Just leave me in peace. I just want to rebuild. Wow, they destroyed the uh, the towers so so intensely that I can't even rebuild them. That's nuts. Yeah, they really need to add some new uh, defenses or defensive upgrades. It is, uh... It's, it's a little unbalanced at the moment. Okay, anyway. Uh, let's see. Alright, they're still getting through. There's still one more ship. Okay, good. Thank God. Alright. Whew. Jeez. Alright. Who needs Norias now? That guy needs a Noria? That guy needs a Noria? That guy, that guy, that guy, that guy, that guy. I think that's gonna connect it now. Let's go ahead and rebuild all these walls. Jeez. We're going straight ballista action. Yeah, 
Alright, let's get some defenses started over here. How high is that? Is that too high? That might be perfect. I don't know. Why can't I select it? Oh, that's weird. So the game, I think, it, I think it's just glitching because it's so laggy right now. I'm not able to select my walls. But yeah, this is weird. Look, I'm not able to... Uh... Oh, hold on. Okay, there we go. I don't know. Am I just being dumb? Something seems different. Like the visual. Like it's not selecting the outline. Yeah, it's not selecting the outline of the frame. Usually you can hover over it and it'll show you, you know, like a like a ghost outline. Weird. Any hoozle. Happiness is super high because everybody's happy about uh, the decimation of the Vikings. So that's great. And that's right, I was planning some more stuff and things over here. Let's go ahead and do one more farm like that. And we'll do the aqueduct straight up like a so. All right, this is all connected. Is it still irrigating everything? Looks like everything is receiving water. As far as I can tell. Looking good, baby. We're looking good. Is everything rebuilt? I think so. Okay, cool. Uh, four years until the Vikings come back. Alright, let's continue building defenses. Looks like that is the correct height. Let's continue doing defenses, of course. Ballista, ballista. Just sort of at least place a few of them around, you know. I want to get something going. It, that was the proper height. There we go. Do another ballista. Alrighty. And we need another mason over here somewhere. You know what? Let's just go... Oh, wait. We have a mason right there. You know what? Let's just double him up. Oh, yeah. Crap. We were going to... Make sure this stockpile only stocks. Let's make it only stock iron, tools, and charcoal. Cool. How are these bakers doing? He doesn't have enough food. What a little baby. It might just be too far. Well, no, there's no way it's too far away. The food's right here. I think they're just not, they're just not having enough. They're just not making enough. So let's go ahead and help him out. Do another do another orchard lack of so. Actually, we're not gonna do a farm right there, we're gonna do a road. Like of that and we're gonna do let's do a small granary like a so I was thinking about doing another mason right there but I could put him over here near the bottom that could be kind of cool all right let's see let's uh, speed time up a little bit more Where else do is it? Is everybody doing 
doing good with uh, food. It looks like everybody's good with food for for now at the moment. So that's good to know. Go ahead and do some more defenses because this place is gonna get absolutely thrashed. Uh, let's do right here. this end point. There we go. Beautiful. Oop, not Archer Tower. Alright, we got it. We got it. We got a few things up and running. Those defenses are going to take a little while right here, unfortunately. Madeline has died of old age, along with 71 other peasants. Madeline, you will be missed, my dear. You will be missed. Alright, one year until the Vikings come again, my god. Go ahead and throw a festival, keep these peeps partying. They had another food shortage, my god. <laughs> That's funny how you can put, uh... <laughs> Look at that! The, uh, the aqueduct pillar is, like, right in the middle of the fountain. <laughs> that makes a lot of sense. All right, um, let's do, I think I'll do some more charcoal stuff and things over here. Just to make sure we're good on charcoal. And let's actually go ahead and do a road connecting around. So we're doing a market right there. That's actually storing quite a bit of food. Let's go ahead and do another small greenery. Whoop! The lag army. Right, where are they at? Let's slow down time a little bit. It's year 753. They're attacking already. My god. That was quick. Well, they're getting thrashed pretty, pretty good. I still haven't uh, upgraded that tower yet. <laughs> it's just a tiny little guy, just chilling, you know, just hanging out. Maybe I just need to build all my towers, like, as high as you can possibly build them, so that, so that it makes it even more difficult for the uh, ogres to destroy them. Alright, getting repaired by the masons right on. Okay, this looks like a good one. These guys are getting absolutely destroyed. Oh, the lag's real. Alright, we don't need to sell anything because we don't even have enough space to uh, store any more gold at the moment. So it would be kind of cool to build a couple more treasuries somewhere. Not sure where, though. Not sure where. Alright, so they attacked on multiple fronts, my god. Looks like these are a lot of the ogres over here. Jeez, look at that lag. It's like I'm watching a flip book. It's just like frame by frame. Are these all ogres? No, no. Just, uh, just most of them. Oh, it's too bad my defenses didn't get built yet. That's a shame. Alright, let's go ahead, throw another festival, keep these peeps happy. There's another food shortage again. Uh, 
In my head, I'm thinking right now if I want to do a fountain in the middle here. Might be a good idea. Now let's do a fountain. And... I don't know, I feel like people are probably getting enough charcoal, right? Yeah, they seem okay with charcoal. But just to make sure, because I know I'm going to put more houses over here. Let's go ahead and do one more charcoal. Alright, I know the Vikings... Yeah, they destroyed lots of walls. Oh, no, it's... Oh, gosh. Darn it. <laughs> this poor aqueduct. It's never going to survive. Did they... Did they do any more? They did right there. Jeez. Those catapults are OP, man. Is everything repaired? Sounds like they're still here. <laughs> All right. Yeah, they're still attacking. Jeez, what the heck? <laughs> It's so goofy. Like, all right, okay, if you insist. All right, how's the aqueduct over here? Is it okay? That's irrigated, that's irrigated. I think it's okay. I think we're all right. They're still repairing some of these. I just need more masons, man. It's crazy how many masons I need because there's just so much damage going on at one time. It is nuts. It's knocking butts, man. Knocking butts. Anyway, they're pretty much dead. They can't really do a whole lot at this point in time. So anyway, guys, I think we're going to leave the episode off there. Hope you guys are still enjoying these series. As always, if you are, a massive thumbs up would be appreciated. And a subscription, as always, as said at the beginning of the episode, would also be absolutely amazing. <laughs> anyway, guys, with that, I will see you peeps in the next one.